Good evening, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com. We are giving away two more Star Wars Stellar spots in this 2017 Bowman Draft uh, baseball break. Super Jumbo, one box of Super Jumbo. Break number eight from jazbeeshobbyland.com. Big thanks to these folks for getting into the action right here. And uh, there's no nationals. Uh, so in the randomizer at the end, we'll do a separate dice roll. So the top two names in the randomizer will get Star Wars Stellar spots. It's a $240 value. And the third person will get any uh, nationals cards that may pop out of here. All right, so let's do the randomizer first for the names and teams. Five and a two, seven times. Names first. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seventh and final time. So there's seven times right there. And we've got William all the way down to Tyler. That's actually for, uh, for his dad, Jeff. Hi, Jeff. There you go. So they don't mix up the hits. Five and a two, seven times. One. Two, three, four, five, six, and seventh and final time. After seven times, we got Padres down to Rangers. Remember, uh, trades are allowed, but remember it's uh, 2017 prospects. So be aware of that before you make any crazy trades. William with the Padres, that's a good one. Alex with the Cardinals and the Red Sox. Tim Haynes with the Marlins. That's pretty solid. Eric with the Rockies. Tyler got my Dodgers. Michael G with the Reds. Darren McKenzie, Mariners. Rich with the Braves. Brew Crew and Cubbies for EA Sports. Johnny L with the Tigers. Eric with the Pirates. Alex with the uh, Twins. Ed Ramos with the Indians. Tim Haynes with the White Sox. William, Rays. Uh, Michael Gallucci, Angels. Rich with the Diamondbacks. That's your last spot mojo right there, too. That's a solid team as well. Diamondbacks. For Rich, Michael with the Blue Jays, Alex with the Giants, Tyler with the Royals, Jason with the Orioles, Alan, you got the Astros, Tyler with the Mets, Karen with the A's, Rich with the Phillies, uh, Andrew with the Yankees, and the Rangers there for Jeff. All right, let's sort by team. And let me know if there's any trades. So Alex trying to move the uh, Cardinals, perhaps. And here is the box right here. I just randomly grabbed a box from the case that we opened. So it's box number one. Did my famous eating meeny miny mo method. This obviously has five chrome autographs per box. There you go. So it's a lot of cards right there. I should have the uh, 2017 MLB draft. I like having this, this open. I just want the Wikipedia page. There it is. So there you go. So I don't think Hunter Green is in this set, but I we've seen a plenty of Royce Lewis's, Mackenzie Gore. So any of these like top like ten picks or whatever are are pretty are pretty strong. You know, let's increase the font a little bit here. So uh, so yeah. So he, like Royce Lewis, obviously for the Twins. Twins are a good team. Padres. You know, Brandon McKay's on the box. He's a two-way player like Otani. Kyle Wright is in here. Austin Beck is in here. Pavin Smith. Although we haven't seen a lot of Pavin Smith, I feel like, in this. Uh, Adam Hazley. Hiuda. Jordan, Joe Adele. Jordan Adele is selling really well for the Angels. You know, and all these first-round guys pretty much, you know, are, are, are pretty strong. Oh, they all, you know, basically they just have to make the majors, right? And then we're in good shape. All right. Does not look like there's going to be any trades. Oh, uh, Tyler's saying Royals for Mariners, maybe? Where are the, there are the Royals. I don't know if D-Mac is in the room. Darren, if you're listening, if you feel like doing that trade, let me know. I'll give it another 20 seconds or so to see. Oh, okay. Tim and Alex. Cardinals, White Sox. Great. Then the chat. There we go. Cardinals White Sox are confirmed. So Alex now has the White Sox. Tim now has the Redbirds. There we go. I think we'll close up the trade window. That's, we got a trade in.
right, let's print this guy out. And let's get this break going. This is the box with the, uh, the sausage link packs. There's the official list, hot off the presses, right there. So Wednesday the 17th, there's everyone right there. So that was a, tra I'd like to see who draws first blood in this trade. We'll write T for trade right here. There you go, Is it, uh, it looks like it's almost time for some new ink. Maybe I'll just shake the toner a little bit, try to get a little more out of there. William Hummel, what's going on? Dilly dilly to you as well. Those are some pretty funny commercials. All right, let's open up all these packs and we'll see what see, we'll see what we got. Five autographs and uh, plus plenty of parallels to look forward to. Anything crazy happening in the baseball world? I, a lot of free agents not signed yet. I feel like. I know there was the big Andrew McCutcheon trade. Um, but I guess, you know, there's not too much. I mean, you know, Garrett Cole was traded, but that's kind of old news. We talk about sports every day here, so there's not much going on. You know, like, cool. Like, Cubs are going to re sign Brian Dunsing. Yay. Where are the where are the big free agents? Come on, get to work, Scott. Scott Boris. A lot of a lot of those guys are your clients. JD Martinez, I think. Jake Garrietta, I think too. Get to work. Start start getting some guys signed. Like awesome. Met signed Jay Bruce. Curtis Granderson to the Blue Jays. Whoop de doo. I like Curtis Grant. He's a good dude, though. So Rick is saying an unknown free agent, a big free agent, is going to hold out until mid-season. Is that true? That would be an interesting move. All right. Let's make some interesting moves here, folks. Let's see what we got. So you can almost see that they're divided between paper and chrome. This chrome is what ships. This paper will not ship, folks. This will ship. All of these beautiful cards here. All right. More paper. this oh go this way right here there you go so all that paper doesn't ship all of this ships of course and then we've got obviously the numbered paper ships 109 out of 250 purple paper Matt Tabor for Rich and the Diamondbacks we'll top load these a little bit later there is Connor Siebold 196 out of 200 that's the 70th anniversary one that's for the Philly that's also for Rich Rich with a couple parallels to start things off and our first autograph is a parallel nice Quinton Holmes Quinton Holmes. That's for Ed Ramos and the Tribe. That is 006 out of 250. 64th overall pick. You could tweet at him, Ed, if you want to. Had committed to had committed to Mississippi State. Served as a peer tutor at his high school. All right, wise guy, huh? And as what? Well, look at this. Volunteered at nursing homes and children's hospitals. And he's a ball player. Man, overachiever. 
All right, so good for Quinn. And good for Ed with that hit. All right, next one here. Paper, don't need it, don't want it. These guys we do want. color coming up. Let's see what we got. We got Ernie Clement and oh, a couple chrome cards and Blaine Edlow. 143 out of 150 for the Twins. That goes to Alex Carmichael with the Twins. There's the autograph coming up. Ariel Huardo. That's the uh, purple chrome, 159 out of 250. That's for the Rangers. That'll be for Jeff. And the auto is for the Diamondbacks. Nice Paven Smith. That is for Rich and the Snakes. Nice. Your seventh overall pick has three sisters, Rich. Drafted by Colorado out of high school where he also did some pitching. Grew up a Marlins fan. Oh, he was born in Jupiter, Florida. Okay. Grew up a Marlins fan, but when Der uh, but with Derek Jeter as his favorite player. Interesting. Now Derek Jeter is part owner of that team. Eh? Speaking of which, there's, there's his favorite guy right there. There you go. We've learned something new about Paven Smith. Yeah, poor kid, says Rich. Group of Marlins fan, all. I wonder if Derek Jeter is still his favorite. Wasn't Joe Perez one of the guys that was sent for uh, Garrett Cole? Oh, the three sisters part. Yeah, I wonder where he lands in the in in the in the totem pole. If he's the youngest, that dude was 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 carted around like, you know, doing tea parties and whatnot. <laughs> hair and braids. Don't put your brother's hair in braids. Uh, four ninety three out of four ninety nine. There you go. That's Ernie Clement for the Indians. And Sam Carlson for the Mariners. D-Mac, Darren McKenzie with the Mariners. There you go. Your 35th or your 55th overall pick. You want to learn about Sam, Darren? He planned to attend the University of Florida. Dog lover. Who isn't? A former USA Baseball 18-under uh, national team member and grew up a, a, a fan of the Twins and Joe Maurer. There you go. He may face them someday. Paper, some more chrome. When's Dylan Tate gonna make it? I feel like he he was a he was a high round draft. He was fourth overall back in 2015, but I feel like I feel like we've not really seen him blossom as a lot of people had hoped he would.
maxing up my stacks here. All right, we've got some Nick Gordon. 98 out of 99. D. Gordon, of course, his older brother. Tom Gordon, their father. Flash Gordon. Kyle Wright. And nice blue chrome. Austin Beck. 14 out of 150. This is a nice one. A's, that's for Karen. He's your eighth overall pick. There you go. Kind of looks like Carney Lansford. The autograph is. Nice. Keston Hiuda for the Brew Crew. I know that this guy seems to do pretty well on a secondary market. EA Sports, it's in the game. 496 out of 499. Studying business economics in college. He went to UC Irvine, of all places. Not exactly, it doesn't strike me as a baseball powerhouse, but uh, played for USA Baseball Collegiate National Team. Uh, he's a California guy, too, Southern California. Never eat egg yolks, only egg whites. There you go. There he is. Nice hit for EA Sports. Some more paper. Chrome. That's one, two, three, four autographs. So we should be expecting one more. Who could it be? Who could it be now? Do, 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 do. All right, yeah, I think it's coming up here. All right, Adam Hazley. 234 out of 499. Won a gold medal. Nicknamed Rev in college. And a Chipotle enthusiast? Chipotle enthusiast. Huh. I don't know if you want your ball. That's, that's actually not that bad, I guess. All right. Oh, there's Gavin Lux. Green Chrome. 49 out of 99. Gavin Lux for the Dodgers. Nice one for Tyler. And the next autograph is, wow, another Brewer. Tristan Lutz autograph. That's another one for Eric. EA Sports, it's in the game. Two nice Brewers autographs. He's 34th overall. Got two first rounders out there. He play, uh, planned to play at the University of Texas. Attended the same high school as Todd Van Poppel. Remember Todd Van Poppel, you guys? Maintained a 3.8 GPA. Smart guy. Admires Andrew Benintendi and likes rap music. There you go. Good old Tristan Lutz. Nice break for the Brewers. I think that's it, folks, unless there's another parallel hiding in here somewhere, which I don't think there is. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. All right, time to give away two Star Wars Stellar spots. That break, that Star Tops Star Wars Stellar Signatures break, is now down to eight spots left. So if you want to buy spots straight up, go for it. Or you can keep joining these breaks, and you can try to get um, one of the two spots that we're giving away, or I guess all two if you buy more than one spot. Good luck to everyone. So the top two will get Star Wars Stellar Signature Spots. That's a $240 value. That's a good deal. And uh, and the third person will get any Nationals cards that we may or may have pulled. All right, so let's roll that dice. Let's randomize that list six and a four ten times. Good luck, everybody. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and tenth and final time. Congrats to... William and Johnny. After 10 times, there you go. William with a spot in Star Wars Stellar Signatures. Great stuff. 
And you too, Johnny. Congrats, Eric. You'll get some Nationals cards if there's any that were pulled there. Thanks, everybody. Another one-box break of 2017 Bowman Draft Super Jumbo in the store right now. Only on jazpyshobbyland.com. Win Star Wars seller stuff. Thanks, everybody. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.